nutrition plays a very important role in the overall treatment and management of the patients suffering from cancer. We all know that the tolerance to the treatment, whether it's surgery, radiotherapy, or chemotherapy, it requires the good nutrition. If the patient has got the low protein, low albumin, all of us know that the results are poor in those patients who have anemia, who have a low albumin and globulin, their prognosis is poor. Also, we know that uh, some of these patients, like breast cancer, if they take high fat diet after the uh, surgery, they have a higher chance of relapse. So they must try to eat low fat diet and uh, keep the uh, fat, fat uh, uh, whole volume in the body low. In fact, they should consume more. So overall, the nutrition plays a very important role. All of us, we advise the patient. We advise them, take little high protein diet, which includes the milk, curd, cheese, paneer. We also advise them to take uh, those who are very uh, you know, malnourished and all, take high calorie diet in which they can have even like something like ice creams because that will have small volume but high calories. So like that we can manage the patients with respect to the nutrition. So both in the management tolerance as well as the subsequent results, the nutrition plays a very important role. And therefore, the advice with regard to the nutrition becomes very important. However, I must say that public has a lot of myths which uh, have to be really ca carefully looked into it. Uh, all these myths, they are rotating around the social media and people are following that, which uh, can cause more harm. Like patients are kept on the no raw foods that can do re definitely more harm. Patient is told not to take the milk and milk product without any reason. Similarly, patients are also told don't eat sweets. I think that takes away 30% of the calories from the patient's diet. And therefore, patients start losing weight and becomes weaker and weaker. So I think myths have to be avoided. Therefore, they need to receive the scientific knowledge and advice and information with respect to the nutrition.